Newbie Dash. So there's Rainbow Dash as a uh, Wonder Bolt, like with the uh, uniform, whatever. And uh, so I guess this will be expanding on that story. This has a 6.1 on IMDb, so that's uh, that's not good. <laughs> so I guess Rainbow is gonna be like properly a Wonder Bolt now, because there was the episode where she like hung out with the Wonder Bolts and then she was in the Academy or something. I don't remember it that well. And I guess she's gonna have a hard time fitting in with the Wonder Bolts because she's new. So for the fast like I don't know pretty much this whole season really so far anyway I haven't said much of anything but like I feel like this one in particular like there's just so little to say it's like okay what like Glimmer getting being more than just the villain and now she's like getting redeemed a little bit that's really it though I mean none of these episodes have been interesting I barely remember any of them see what what even happened there was um the baby was born in the first two episodes there was the one about Spike and the dragon thing there was the one the last one was uh what was that that was Trixie and Glimmer being friends. Yeah, I already forgot what happened in, what would that be, episodes like three to five? I don't remember those at all. Well, yeah, I really just can't remember. <laughs> I'm sure if I see the title or like a frame from the episode, I'll remember. But yeah. Oh yeah, one of them was about the Unimark Crusaders and how they're like, or how Apple Bloom doesn't know what she wants to do in life or something. But yeah, mostly just very forgettable and boring. And it's like during most of them, I'm just kind of staring at the screen, just like, this is going into my eyeballs. When I watch other shows, it's like, I'm either laughing or shocked or just like what the f what is happening oh my gosh i'm like freaking out in my mind but with this show it's just so tame and boring it's just like okay this is happening like other than just saying what's happening like this character is doing this now other than just saying that there's so little to to point out or say or react to i feel like my reactions have just been basically nothing <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it'll change this episode. So there's these two. So I think this is like uh, the same kind of thing they were talking about with the uh, other episode where Rainbow had to perform or whatever. Because there's the evil guy. I don't remember. Oh, she gets upgraded. She's like, uh, yeah, she's a proper Wonderbolt now. And I guess she's not able to handle it. She's like shocked. I feel nothing. Still fucking hate that intro. <laughs> I don't think that's ever going to change, honestly. Like, I don't know. This is what I mean. This is just a bunch of... They're just explaining stuff. There's nothing funny, entertaining, interesting, emotional. Like, she's just saying, oh, I gotta go to this thing. Oh, there's the sappy music. Oh, this is gonna be a big challenge for her. <sighs> oh my god. It's just so obnoxious and nothing. Yeah, so she's just clearly gonna have some problems fitting in because Rainbow doesn't know about all the rules and stuff, so she has to take it more seriously. Like, I'm just so goddamn bored. She looks like a blue panda. I don't know why, actually. It makes me think of that. Oh no, she didn't look both ways. And now they're just gonna get crashed. Oh no. Oh, here we go again with Rainbow Crash. The funniest joke in the whole goddamn universe. I guess this is the origin of that name. Ah, that is so funny. Oh my, this joke was kind of funny the first time they did it in like season one. And then it just became unfunny. Now it's every time they repeat it, it's so, it gets less and less funny and more and more grating. Oh my god, and then everything that happens just so, it's so slow. It just feels so slow. It's also a bit uncharacteristic of her to be this much of a klutz. What, is she gonna be removed from the team or something? Oh no, it's just, it's like a sorority or sobriety. Is that what it's called? I don't even know. Where they do the hazing thing for the new person. That's kind of what this is like. Now there's these assholes. God, I am so bored. Like, they're just, it's glorified reading. <laughs> it's like, it's just... Rainbow trash! <laughs> Okay, that was- that was almost funny. They could have called her Rainbow Trash. <sighs> okay, you got me there. Oh no. No, she's gonna get the wrong idea. And- and she's gonna like do something that's gonna screw up what's the routine supposed to be. Oh my gosh. Oh, she's- she's pretending to be each of the, uh, the main characters. The first one was Pinky, now she's Applejack, because she's changing the hair. And I guess this is supposed to be funny, because she's imitating each character. Ugh. Now she's Twilight. Oh, I give so few fucks right now. <laughs> Reading Rainboom. Yeah, there's she's Fluttershy now. <sighs> she's missing one. Oh my gosh. <sighs> oh my 
gosh, Rainbow Fash. Oh, her, her nickname is Crash, so that's what's on her jacket. I have nothing at all. I don't even see what anyone could enjoy about this. Like, like, what? Like, I can't think of one positive thing to say. And now Rainbow wants to use, uh, Skullaloo for, uh, for some kind of thing she's gonna add to the show when she really shouldn't be doing it. Or no, so she's gonna have Skullaloo skate down the ramp, and then Rainbow's going to have to save, uh, save Skullaloo. And that's what it's supposed to be. Okay, no, it's so that, it's so that she gets some, she looks fancy or whatever. There's this scene of getting... Just cotton candy. Oh, they're doing the flying. Oh no, she's going off off the uh, planned thing, and now she's screwing it up. And now she's just embarrassing herself. Ah, no, no. I guess I'm supposed to be laughing. I don't know. Oh, there. After all that, she still got she still got shocked by the lightning. There's the cotton candy. Oh no, her cotton candy's all gone. Oh, she ruined everything again. <sighs> Yeah, it's all about how she's she's not special with the Wonder Bolts. It's kind of like uh, when you're in like middle school and elementary school, you might be like a gifted student or whatever, but then you're not special once you get you know higher advanced stuff and everyone else is. I don't know what I'm saying. And I guess they all have they all screwed up on their first day though. That's like the whole point here. Yeah, she has to learn to not be a show off. That's that's the whole point of this episode. There's even more direct dialogue. Just this is my responsibility. I need to take responsibility for my actions because I made a bad mistake. Because this is an important lesson to learn. Oh my gosh, here we are with the lesson. So f fucking boring. So yet another boring episode. There was this idea of Rainbow, you know, progressing through her story as becoming a Wonderbolt, but still not really interesting in any way. Or, oh, I mean interesting to watch. It's still so boring. So the story, Rainbow is gonna is becoming an actual Wonderbolt now. She was before just in the reserves. So now she's an actual Wonderbolt and then she goes into her first day of training to do a show, but um, she doesn't fit in. Basically, she's just she's trying to be a show-off and doesn't understand how to follow the rules and, and all that so then they start calling her rainbow crash and so then rainbow feels bad about herself and she feels like she needs to do some big amazing thing to uh to redeem herself so she isn't called rainbow crash but then she just ends up screwing up the show even more and then she realizes that she can't be a show off and she has to just be something <laughs> she has to just you know follow, follow the rules and stuff and all that shit i was just so bored throughout this episode i mean really like absurdly bored it's just so so slow. I mean, I guess I don't know. I feel like maybe like this is another one where I don't really think it should be an 11 minute segment, but like it should have something else in the episode. I mean, it's just a bunch of scenes of Rainbow being like, oh, I'm gonna be a show off. Oh shit, that didn't work. It's just kind of a bunch of that, and then one final scene with her doing it at, at the uh, at the show, and then finally learning her lesson. I mean, I guess there's some ideas that this kind of gets like when you join a new club or whatever, and you're the noob, you're the new person, so it's like awkward you don't know how to act so like, i guess it got that kind of scenario right it's still just so like like every other show that i can think of that i watch it's there's always something really interesting to talk about or, or think about and i mean some shows like uh, bojack horseman or R rick and morty there's a lot of just scenes of just talking but the ideas and perspectives they take on those things are so interesting and obviously that's the nature from an adult show whereas a kid's show you're not going to have those really nuanced things with interesting ideas you know you're just going to have the basic lesson and like, oh, isn't it hard to fit in? Sometimes you just need to, to you know, try to follow the rules and stuff and understand what your what your purpose there is or whatever. You know, you don't have to be a show-off. It's a simple lesson. And, you, I mean, like other shows like Gravity Falls, Star, Adventure Time, they all have those simple lessons. I guess sometimes they get, get a little more interesting. But just th watching the episode isn't interesting. It's not entertaining. There was, I think, one joke where I, like, laughed a little bit, like, <laughs> like that. It was, like, Pinky said how they, they could, at least they didn't call rainbow they didn't call her rainbow trash instead of rainbow crash that's kind of funny that's it though i remember one stupid line and that's a out of a 20 minute episode just the level of boredom like i don't know, even even when there's like a bad episode of adventure time or a bad episode of gumball i'm still entertained by it because it's still so absurd and so fast-paced and like there's still <laughs> there's still infinitely more moments in those show in, in bad episodes of those shows where i'm like like yeah this is great than any average episode of this show i don't know i'm 
I'm rambling at this point. I have nothing else to add about this particular episode. So I give I give this um, three out of ten. It had some level of character development and stuff, but just nothing I give a shit about in, in the episode. Just so uninteresting. Also, it does kind of seem a little out of character for Rainbow to be like to be this just much of a klutz. I mean, it's the whole point is that she's trying to show off when she shouldn't be, but whatever. God, I just give so few fucks.